Hey guys, welcome to another video. Um, right now, we're in a very new location. Riley is having a fanboy moment. No, I'm not. I'm not having a little bit of a fangirl moment, but uh, I didn't realize that uh, Linus Tech Tips, which is like this huge online YouTuber review person, is actually based really close to us. We're going to Costco, obviously, because that's a regular weekend activity, but we would just decide to stop by and just check out their office. It's over there. <laughs> Pretty cool that we can visit such a big YouTuber here, uh, local to us. <laughs> Is it stalking? We're quite far away. We're technically not on their property, so. Okay, let's go back in the car. All right, let's get going. <laughs> We just got back from grocery shopping and it was so boring we didn't even want to bother showing you guys but we <laughs> tried to go to a new grocery store in Langley. It's called Hannam Supermarket. We usually like to try different buns. I feel like we always try buns on our videos. And we actually haven't tried too many uh, Korean buns either. Mostly they're just like Chinese buns. It has hot dogs in it and cheese and some kind of sauce and they call it a pizza bun. It smells so good. So cheesy. Yeah. It's actually pretty big. It is. This was $3. three dollars. Three twenty or so. Everything at this grocery store was like kind of expensive. Yeah. Just to give some context, like this place is brand new. I made a wrong turn and we had to go all the way around and then make a left turn into the parking lot. Um, so there's this stupid guy in the parking lot who was blocking the whole entrance and like a ton of people were trying to come in He did not want to move so I was like backed up and then some guy behind me who's driving like this hot rod old car or whatever It was like super pissed off and he just wanted to go around so I pulled forward So that he could like go around or whatever and I'm driving such a small car, right? So like no problem He continues to tailgate me for some odd reason. I was like you could have just went around he got so frustrated, he got out of his car, came up to my window, and started yelling at me. I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> There's nothing we could have done. And I was like, okay. So I rolled up my window and I just ignored him. He went back to his car and then like quite soon after, I made a left turn. That parking lot is not very well designed. I like everything about the grocery store. It's like super unique and cool, but I do not like that parking lot. Can we eat? <laughs> okay, fine. Enough story time. Let's just eat. Thanks. All right. Okay, cool. <laughs> There's tomato sauce in here. Mm -hmm. It's literally like a pizza. It has peppers yeah. and sausage and onion. You should learn how to make these buns. Mm -hmm. Or maybe yeah, we should try them. All right, now that we're done with our appetizer, we're gonna go make dinner. You guys know that Sam has a secret hidden talent? Um, I can kind of read the Korean alphabet. I learned it because one day I was scrolling through Facebook and a infographic picture diagram came up with the letters and I was bored so I just learned it. <laughs> and every time she reads it, I don't believe her because it sounds so Riley similar to English. doesn't believe me. Like this says ramyeon. <laughs> this is why I don't believe you. I have trust issues okay. because of you. And then this one, the, this one, it says Pizza bun. <laughs> yeah, every time we go to the grocery store, sometimes she'd be like, yo, test cover the English and like I'll read it for you and like I didn't see how try it goes. This one yet. Oh, this one's Japanese. I can't read Japanese. <laughs> Alright, that's your next task. What about this one? I didn't um it takes me a long time to figure it out. So this says um do bu a mook. I think. Well, I don't know. I guess it means fried fish cake. <laughs> <laughs> so you can read it, but you don't. Sometimes you don't understand. <laughs> well, I don't understand Korean. I can because Korean is like the. It's just like alphabet letters, so you can piece it together to make the sounds. But I don't actually know Korean. <laughs> Man, I had so high hopes for her of touring us around Korea, reading everything. Our personal tour guide. I guess she'll have to study harder. Sam's got a little surprise for lunch over here. <laughs> I have no idea what she's doing, but I will leave the camera with you and... With me? Sure. But, uh... I tried really hard, but it turned out to be very ugly. I'm not the best 
plater. No, it's okay. I'm sure it's still food. So, <laughs> all right, let's try it. Let's see. What'd you do? What'd you do? What happened to your plate? <laughs> well, Where'd your plate go? Well, you see, the first egg I made, I messed up really badly. So, um, I just tossed my plate together in whatever. But I tried to plate yours to make it look prettier, but... Wait, wait, hold on. Explain to me what you did here. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to go for um, a beautiful curry dish with rice topped with an egg. But I think I went overboard and there's too much curry. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to save it with some garnish. Oh yeah, the green onions here. Mm -hmm. I like that. Your homegrown green onions. Yeah, alright. Yeah. Thanks for lunch, no man. Alright, let's eat. Okay. It's good. I like it. Oh, man. The presentation's cute. <laughs> Right now we're at Crescent Beach Park and we this is Crescent Beach and it's not very beachy looking. Right now it's just all rocks and logs and stuff. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. All along the beach, there's um, clumps of seaweed, and well, we thought it was seaweed, but then we saw this sign, and turns out it's something called eel grass. They're actually still alive, so right now it's low tide, but when the tide comes up, the eel grass is just like in the water, like this, and so you're technically not supposed to step on the eel grass. We didn't know that, we thought it was just piles of dead seaweed. So all along the beach, we've kind of just been walking on it. So hopefully we didn't destroy anything. We found a lot of sticks growing things. They kind of look like bamboo, but I have no idea what they are. It's pizza night. <laughs> pizza movie. Yeah, we got five pizzas. <laughs> five? Oh, yeah. So each mini pizza or each personal size pizza is five dollars which was way cheaper than getting like a big pizza plus we get to try different flavors <laughs> okay that one's chicken wow this is smaller than i imagined it is smaller than i imagined no wonder they're only five dollars each oh this one's hawaiian we made a critical mistake in our calculation. Yeah, so we saw the prices of the other pizzas and we're like, oh, personal's fine. The other ones were $15, $20, you know, the regular prices for yeah. a medium or large. But uh, yeah, the size difference is considerably different because we thought that maybe two personal pizzas equals like... Like a medium. A medium. <laughs> In no universe is that true, so please do not make that mistake. These are for like little toddler baby things, so like yeah. one bite pizzas really. Good thing we got five because we were originally like, oh yeah, like three's fine. Pizza and a movie, best night ever. With this, it concludes our <laughs> weekend and thanks for joining us on this weekend's lame adventures <laughs> throughout this whole pandemic and all its twists and turns. Order yourself a pizza and treat yourself. <laughs> See you guys. Bye.